Hello Sycamore, happy Tuesday. Today is March 7th, 2023. Welcome to this episode of our delayed video announcements. I'm Harper. And hello, it's Terrific Twins Tuesday, and I'm Eli. We're so excited to have this great opportunity to join you all on the daily video announcements. Now let's all please stand, place our hands over our heart, and honor this amazing country as we say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, and please be seated. Remember, to check your emails throughout the day. And be PBIS responsible adults. Be safe, be respectful, be a problem solver, and be responsible. Good luck for the Flex Bells participating in Noam and Danny's Flex Bell Challenge. May the best pencil bouncer win. Okay, mark and check your calendars, people. Continuing our fun student council weeks, today is Twins Tuesday. Whoever twinned with a friend really outdid themselves. Tomorrow, Wednesday, need some planning and safety precautions. Wednesday is anything but your backpack day. Over to Mr. Cole for our admin team for some very helpful and important safety guidelines for tomorrow. All right, good morning, aviators. Uh, my inbox is filling up with questions about anything but a backpack spirit day on Wednesday. Um, just to answer a couple of specific questions, no, you can't bring your younger sibling, uh, nor a toboggan. Uh, in general, as you're thinking about what to bring, you want to make sure that you can move through the hallways without disturbing other students. You can go up and down stairs. Um, you can have it in your classroom. It's not a general uh, overarching massive distraction to class, right? So uh, I'm super excited to see the creativity that our aviators bring. Uh, if you have specific questions, uh, you can ask me uh, or Miss Shunk, and we will help you out. Have a great day. Thanks, Mr. Cole. And yes, remember to keep it safe and fun with your friends. And don't forget about Thursday and Friday. Thursday is decades where we're anything from any decade. And Friday is Freaky Friday where a student and teacher switch places. Oh my, that's going to be super fun. I can't wait to see all the creativity these next few days. One more item to add to your calendar. Next week on Tuesday, March 14th, we're supporting our, our friends with cerebral palsy by wearing green. Did you know that over 1 million people in the United States are living with cerebral palsy? Let's show our support by wearing green next Tuesday. Got it. Adding that to my list. Wear green next Tuesday. Now, today's Women's History Month. For today's Women's History Month, we will be featuring Princess Diana. Diana, Princess of Wales, was born July 1, 1961 and died August 31, 1997. Diana was a member of the British royal family. She was the first wife of King Charles III, then Prince of Wales, and mother of Princess William and Harry. Her activism and glamour made her an international icon. The, pres the princess was president or patron of over a hundred charities. Diana did so, did so much to publicize work on behalf of homeless and also disabled people, children and people with struggles. Diana used her fame to help spread awareness for many causes. By doing this, she helped save many people. Although Diana died a very tragic death, the things she did for Great Britain and the accomplishments she had will always be recognized. Many, many did and still care and still call her People's Princess. Wow, thanks for all that amazing work and making a difference for so many. That's so awesome. Now over to Paul and Sam with our Did You Know and National Day. Did you know astronaut was allergic to the moon? He was allergic to the moon dust. Wow, I didn't even know that could happen. Today is National Be Heard Day. National Be Heard Day is an occasion for small businesses, <laughs> aspiring owners, to make their voices heard. This day celebrates small businesses and encouraging them to stand up for themselves and their ideas to lay claim to their share of the market. That's cool. Stand up and be heard. Small businesses. Let's hear you. Next up, birthdays. Happy birthday to Sarah I. Yes, happy birthday to all celebrating today. Hope you have an amazing birthday. Now over to Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcement. Hey, this is an announcement from the Media Center. They are cracking down on students borrowing technology and not bringing it back. You guys aren't bringing back chargers. You're not bringing back laptops. They don't loan you technology at the high school, so if you forget your stuff, you're pretty much out of luck up there. You need to learn to be responsible. If you borrow it from the Media Center, bring it back. 
Hey, on Friday, March 10th, in room 140 during Flex Bell, there will be a meeting for any 8th grade girl interested in trying out for girls soccer at the high school next year. If you're interested, but can I attend this meeting on Friday, please send Mrs. Topfer an email or stop by our room so she can record your name. This is for girls high school soccer Friday during Flex Bell. And don't forget to buy your tickets for Footloose. The show will take place on March 10th, 11th, 9th, 10th, and 11th at 7 p.m. at Sycamore High School. This is the Sycamore Junior High version of Footloose. Visit avestheater.org or scan the barcode to get your tickets. That's it for me. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Mr. Harris. Now it's time for the joke of the day. How do you fix a cracked pumpkin? I don't know. How? With a pumpkin patch. <laughs> Be extraordinary, Sycamore, and follow PBIS expectations every day. Have a wonderful week and wear your Spirit Week outfits and go, go Waves! waves!